Subscribe to my channel Imam Salik. My respected brothers, sisters, honorable elders, Ramadan, how to get ready and how to be prepared for the month of Ramadan. My respected brothers, Nabi sallallahu alayhi wa sallam said, Inna Allah la yandu ila suwarikum wa amwalikum. وَلَكِنْ يَنْظُرْ إِلَىٰ قُلُوبِكُمْ وَأَعْمَالِكُمْ Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala does not look towards your faces, towards your appearance, and not towards your authority or status or wealth. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala looks towards your hearts. And Allah looks towards your deeds, your a'mal. They are done from here. If the heart is not there in an amal, it is not accepted. That's why Nabi sallallahu alayhi wa sallam said, Ala inna fil jasad la mudgha, idha saluhat saluha al jasad kullu, wa idha fasadat fasad al jasad kullu, ala wa hi al qalb. Listen carefully, attentively. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has created a piece of flesh in your body. And if that piece of flesh is sound and correct and crystal clear and filled with the sincerity and love of Allah, the pleasure of Allah, and the consciousness of Allah, all of your a'mal are accepted. They will be considered sound, perfect, acceptable. And if that piece of flesh corrupted and gone the other way, what is the other way? Following desires, following styles, following the name and being scared of the people that they, what the people will say about me. What is going to happen? All the a'mal will be rejected. They will be corrupted. And then Nabi sallallahu alayhi wa sallam said three times, Allah. What is Allah? Allah is tambi. Allah is to get someone's attention, to warn someone. Be warned, be advised, be attentive. Wahi al qalb. This is your heart, the heart. So, my brothers, if I am not prepared internally from my heart for the month of Ramadan, if my heart is not conscious and alert and awakened for the pleasure of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. So my a'mal will be just external. So that's why the scholars, they say, we should with every breath of our life, with every step of our life, we should remind, we must remind ourselves one ayah of the Qur'an. What is that ayah? لا تحسبن الله غافلا أما تعمل لا تحسبن الله غافلا don't ever imagine that Allah is ignorant. No one can hide from Allah. Nothing can hide from Allah. I am very smart. I am very, mashallah, known that this is very smart person. But Allah knows my smartness internally and externally. 